as you know, the Apple Pencil has its battery too and it's important to keep track of it. Here is how you can take a look at your current battery status. There are multiple ways by the way, so we're gonna go through it. The first is connecting the Apple Pencil. It is the easiest way to do so and that is by connecting the pencil to the side of the iPad. It's the quickest way to go about it. The battery window will slide out from the side and it will show you instantly what's going on. It's gonna show you that it is Apple Pencil. Uh, there is gonna be like this small widget with the battery percentage and it's gonna show you that it is currently being charged. That is due to the pencil being connected to the iPad. But it's also possible to set up a widget, a battery widget in particular. On the iPad, there are three types of battery widgets and two places where you can put them. You can place them on the home screen somewhere or in the widgets panel on the left side. Both have their places, so it depends on what works for you. Anyways, there are three types of battery widgets by default. You get there by holding on the home screen and clicking on the plus icon in the corner up there. So the first one only shows the status of your current device, which is iPad in our case. So we have to skip this one. But the other two on the other hand are widgets we can use for our needs. So whether you go with the second or third widget, it allows you to see the status of other devices that are paired to your iPad like AirPods or Apple Pencil. So just add it to the home screen, put it wherever it fits and wherever you like it, and you can see it all the time. Actually, the first widget works as well for multiple devices, but it doesn't display the exact percentage, only like the circle with the green outline representing the charge status. So just use pretty much whichever you want, but the other two seem to be better. Or just stick to the widget panel on the left side. The process is very similar with the difference that you need to swipe all the way there to the left side to get this panel and then scroll to the bottom to click on edit and you are presented with the same or similar options so plus button in the corner click it scroll down to find batteries and add whichever battery widget you want so like i said and explained there are multiple types even with lines and other devices with their names pictures and battery status so there is a lot to pick from and put it to the side well, the thing is that you can only organize them vertically and you can only get there by swiping all the way there to the left side in the widgets panel. So it's not always there, but you can just always slide there from the main screen on the home screen. So it's also another option. It just really depends on what you like. Or you can, for example, download this app. The link will be down below in the description and you can go ahead and download it and see for yourself. So there are third party apps which allow you to see uh, the battery and the percentage of the battery of other devices which are paired to your iPad. And this can include some other info about the products too. So just make sure that the app has access to your device's Bluetooth. So if it asks you for that, you need to allow it to make sure that it is going to work and you have to allow it in order for the app to track your Apple Pencil's battery. I'm pretty sure that there are other apps like this one out there. I'm just using this one as an example. Anyways, it works pretty well. It shows you all the devices that are currently connected to your iPad. And that includes, of course, Apple Pencil as well. So you can see the battery status, if it's charging or just being connected, how many percent it has and some other identifiers. It's good because it takes up the entire screen and you can see it in more detail. But it doesn't tell you anything different than the widget or than the sliding when you connect the Apple Pencil. So it's pretty much doing the very same thing, just a different way to get there. So these were the three options, how you can uh, check out or take a look at the uh, Apple Pencil battery. If you know any other method, make sure to let me know about that down below in the comments. I would really appreciate it and definitely I'm really excited to see what you write. So thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe to the Fox Tag YouTube channel because you're not going to want to miss the future uploads. Thanks a lot for watching and see you guys later.